While the lockdown has been lifted on Sunday, the SPP and Jihanda's management awaits news from the QRL as to how the ISC season will proceed after the lockdown in southeast Queensland. The PNG Hunters players and staff have been able to maintain normal training routines within the confines of the Gold Coast Performance Center. In a live video interview from Gold Coast today, Coach Matchers gave an update on the current situation. The, the lockdown was lifted on Sunday, so um, there is still a ban on community sports, which includes the Intra Super Cup. Um, we're lucky enough to be in a facility that when it is locked down, it becomes ours and we have private um, use of it. So we can continue as much as normal as possible in terms of our training routine, um, which, you know, our guys, if you give them, give them a bit of structure and routine, they tend to do, do pretty well out of that. So um, yeah, we've still been keeping up with training and, and moving around. It's just, we're just doing a bit of a holding pattern at the moment to see when the competition will resume went on to give an update on the prospects of games for the balance of the season. The easiest way to describe it is we basically have these restrictions in, in place till the 22nd, um, which would rule out next week's game against the Tigers. So this week would have been um, uh, the Tweedhead Seagulls and next week would have been the Tigers. Um, so there's still a potential that next week will go ahead if the um, restrictions ease on Monday. So we're waiting. Mon next Monday is our fallback option. Uh, if they don't, if they don't ease, then um, we'll play round 19 will be our next game. Round 16 and round 17 will be then um, after round 19, but round 18 will be cancelled. He also gave a brief outlook on the Hunters' plans for the off-season moving into 2022 really important for them to get us home see family and yeah thank them for their, their sacrifice as well like you know yes the players making a sacrifice to be here but they're also sacrificing the time of their loved ones and their partners and families so i want to send them home and get them back as soon as possible so they can enjoy some some time and give them a break um we'll be looking to obviously reconvene in port moresby before christmas and train and um, yeah, obviously by then we'll know a greater deal about what our path will look like for 2022. In the interim, the team now looks forward to the competition resuming soon when it is deemed safe to do so. Terry Longwood, TV1 Sports.